The stage is set, and the glittering prize awaits one of these two teams. But which one in the 2022 FIFA World Cup final? Stay with us, you won't miss a minute of action right here on EA TV. Hello and welcome to a contest of colossal meaning. We find ourselves here just to the north of the Doha city centre, ahead of the 2022 World Cup final. My name is Derek Ray and with me to provide expert analysis is Stuart Robson. And as you can imagine on this occasion, the atmosphere is building up nicely. It's Argentina against Brazil. Well, what an occasion for these two sets of players. A chance to be world champions. Let's hope the game matches the atmosphere. It should be an absolute cracker. I can't wait for this to start. The Argentina first team. Well, it's a defensive lineup, that's for sure. But their wing backs and at least one of their midfield players will need to break forward when they regain possession just to give them a threat going forward. The starting 11 for Brazil. Alisson gets the nod in goal. Marquinhos plays alongside Thiago Silva in central defence. Casemiro plays alongside Lucas Paqueta in central midfield. And the striker is the very creative and eye-catching Richarlison. is underway Marcos Acuna oh that's a really good authoritative tackle throw in here Messi so this is it for Argentina World Cup winners in 1978 and 1986 runners up in 1930 1990 and eight years ago in 2014 are they going to do it here in 2022 what a big night for them well it's a massive night when you talk about World Cup finals, I always go back to 1978 as a great occasion. Ticker tape in Buenos Aires. The kickoff delayed because one of the Netherlands players had a cast on his arm. Mario Kempes, brilliant player. Ozzy Ardiles, that was Argentina at their best. Can they reproduce that sort of form here today? I think they can. Playing it in. Well, no problems defensively. Paqueta. Now with Casimiro. A wilting under. A oh, terrific piece of goalkeeping. <laughs> Trying to pick out a teammate. Well, still an issue here. And the keeper more than equal to it. Well, a 
another corner kick conceded. Let's see what they do this time. Next to go short. And he cuts inside. Paqueta. Here's Vinicius Jr. And a fine stop. Can he deliver it with accuracy? Well, really, it had to be further away from the keeper. De Paul. I mean, let's face it, when Messi is on the pitch, you cannot take your eyes off him. What do you think he'll offer in this game, Stuart? Can he finish? And good work to deny the chance. Trying to deliver it accurately. And there it is! Living history! The opening goal of the 2022 World Cup Final. Incredible celebrations! Well, here's the replay. It's certainly a well-delivered ball into the area. And it's a comfortable finish in the end, which is made to look so easy. It's a lovely goal. has restarted 1-0 here Paqueta Neymar on the ball Richarlison not there to intercept Alvarez ball with Danilo Richarlison on to Paqueta oh maybe the equaliser oh terrific save well you're absolutely right that's a top class save just look how he reacts <laughs> delivering it Insufficient guile from that corner. Keeper's ball. Alvarez. Good use of advantage by the referee. Alexis McAllister. And the emphasis is on creativity. Oh, marvellous save. Great goalkeeping. Stoppage in play and a chance for the referee to go back and retrospectively hand out a yellow card. But well, he's gone short with it. Messi. Here's Alvarez. Top class defending. Well, they're going to be very cross with themselves because that was a wasted opportunity.
Casemiro. Now Casemiro. Well, no stopping him. Richarlison. Excellent defending. Well, Argentina haven't had that much of the ball so far, but their attacking play has been really incisive. It's been a really good display from them so far. Yes, and maybe another break brewing here. But after that fantastic effort, it's gone out for a throw-in. An unforced error, you've got to say. Rafinha. Now, Eder Militao. And Neymar! Oh, goal it is! The equaliser in this final! What next in the drama? Well, here's another look, and you can see what a good finish this is. He holds off the defender brilliantly and keeps his composure. That's a great goal. So underway again, following the goal that made things level. Otamendi. Fernandez. Romero. Alexis McAllister. Good use of the ball, but can they trouble the defence? Well, I think a classic commentator's curse just then. Couldn't make the ideal pass. Argentina will get the throw in. Marcos Acuna. Now Messi. Under real pressure defensively. Will they pay the price? Counter-attacking, very much an option. Well, not the pass he had in mind. Fernandez. Here's Alvarez. Messi. Enzo Fernandez. We've had the official word. There will be a minimum of two added minutes. Splendid defending, and it needed to be. Casemiro. And with that, the first half draws to a close. Well, underway once more, and it's going to be fascinating to see what developments occur in the second half. Still on level terms, moving the ball nicely. Eder Militao. There to win it back. Now well Molina. Rodrigo de Paul. Unable to keep the ball. Neymar. Useful looking position, you've got to say. And Neymar. Can they forge ahead? Keeper. Well, they should be ahead now. Yes, it was a good save, Derek, but he should score from there.
And he's fired over the corner. And the problem not completely solved. A gift for any goalkeeper. Difficult to stop him. And Neymar! Well, he's been ruled offside. Far from the ideal pass, you've got to say. Neymar. Now Casemiro. Paqueta. And they will be awarded a free kick for that. No yellow card. Instead, a firm warning from the official. Simple for the keeper. And the quality of pass needs to be a bit better. Rodrigo de Paul. Messi. Promising looking attack. Casemiro Neymar Ball with Danilo Going well Richarlison And reading it absolutely superbly Neymar Attempted to high degree of difficulty to hit it on the volley like that, and it was close. Well, his skill level is so high, you're absolutely right. That's a great effort on the volley. Well, as you can see, they've done everything in terms of creativity, they just need to finish one of these chances off to take the lead. And into the last 20 minutes. Can they take advantage? Paredes. Looking for that final pass. Looking for the goal that would put them ahead. I think I spoke too soon. Wasn't the best of passes finally. Vinicius Junior. And the conditions look pretty good for the counter attack. Messi. And the keeper flings himself at the ball. So making the substitution now. It's a short one. And he takes on the shot. Tremendous block. I'm trying to build ahead of steam. Another corner it'll be. <laughs> Playing it short. Textbook defending inside the box.
And the referee spotted the foul, but has played advantage. Neymar. Can he open them up here? Well, flinging himself at the ball. Well, both teams have had substitutes swarming up, and now both will rely on their respective benches. Trying to pick out a teammate. And a no-nonsense clearance. And Neymar. Richardson. Oh, a goal! And how important could that be? Maybe it's a story of one hand on the trophy at this stage of the final. A huge moment. Well, here's another look. And you can see what a good finish this is. He holds off the defender brilliantly and keeps his composure. That's a great goal. What a big moment in the dying embers. Will it prove decisive here? Well, there's still scope for late drama here. Five minutes left and just one goal between the sides. De Paul. On the attack in the closing phase. Rodrigo De Paul. That's a routine take. Rafinha Pedro It's with Fabinho Richarlison Pedro And return to Casemiro Richarlison This might be ideal for the counter And the referee brings this final to an end for the first time in 20 years. Brazil are world champions once more. Well, no surprise there, Derek. Brazil have been brilliant and they fully deserve this trophy.